matriarchs, princes and princesses, and all you people of noble birth, it is indeed an honor to be here today. I stand here with my chiefs because seven years ago when we began this battle with Enbridge, we were standing alone. We didn't know what the heck we were going to do to push these people back. We know the power of oil, and we knew that the federal government wanted to push this ahead. Seven years ago, we met with Enbridge, and Pat Daniel, as president, said, Coastal First Nations, if you don't want this project in your territory, we won't do it. So all of the Coastal First Nations came together and decided that they didn't want it, and we told them that. And they said, well, you're not the only First Nations in the province. There's a bunch along the pipeline as well. So we met with the folks along the pipeline, and they said, we don't want this project as well. And Enbridge said, well, that's too bad. There's some white communities along the way as well, and we don't think they want the project. So we went to the Union of BC Municipalities, and for quite a number of years now, they've been passing resolutions telling Enbridge to get lost as well. <laughs> Everybody in British Columbia, the Union of BC Indian Chiefs, the Union of BC Municipalities, the First Nations Summit, and all kinds of other people are coming out and saying, we don't want this project in British Columbia. But we have a legislature here that's empty right now, and they're not listening to the people in British Columbia. They think that we're for sale. What do you say to that? think in Ottawa that they can jam this thing over the backs of British Columbians. What are you willing to do to stop them? Are you willing to lay down in front of the bulldozers? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, today is all about you. Coastal First Nations and all of the tribes in the interior, we've been stating our opposition for a long time now. But we're so happy that 3,000 of you have come out to join with us today. 3,000 people. We will. We will. So I want to ask a question. Who's going to lay down in front of the bulldozers? We will! Who's going to change the 26 Conservative MPs in British Columbia if the federal government tries to jam this thing through? We will! Who's going to change the government in, in Victoria if this current government doesn't change the way they're doing business? We and who is going to push Stephen Harbour back if he continues to change the environmental laws? Yeehaw! Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the Hiltzuk and the Haida and the Tsimchan and, and the, and the Kitkatla and all of the tribes that we have here, I want to thank you all for helping us save our land to save your land. The Great Bear Rainforest that we all come from, it's your place. And we want, to, we want to share it with you. So anytime you want to come and visit, you come and see us. You're all welcome. Thank you very much.